like season one was like epic and crazy and everything. How was it like? How was it like reading the script for the first time for season two? Oh, um, certainly super exciting because there was so many things left um, open ended in in season one. So getting to figure out and 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 find out what happened and and what what was going to you know continue happening throughout season two was was always really really fun and and every time we got a script I was just like I am very very happy and excited um yeah I mean I mean the writers do a great job it's it's uh they they keep you on the edge of your seat for sure how about you Anthony yeah a hundred percent I I I was always thrilled to get a new script and you know uh walking into season two it was like an unprecedented time, you know? So it was like a lot of things were new. And um, so it wasn't just the script itself. It was like, how are we going to film this at the start? You know, how is this going to work? Um, and so it, but it, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it was, uh, but it was a really, really fun experience like season one was. And uh, just seeing how these characters developed and seeing uh, where they would go um, is always a blast, you know? Um, we're all really interested in the storylines. I feel like Felix is like one of the like nicest characters ever. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like I was like, he does yeah. really no wrong. Uh, I want to <laughs> know if you will be able to see like Felix end up doing something bad in that coming season. Yeah, I, you know, no one's a perfect human being. So I, I, Felix is obviously human. So th- he definitely has flaws. Um, I think his intention will, I think most likely for the most part, always be pure. And I think that's just who he is. Whether he handles that correctly or not is a different situation, but his intent will always be good hearted. Mm-hmm. Um, and so uh, I, I think he's just one of those people that is, are, you know, just is putting as much love out in the world as he possibly could. Mm-hmm. So it's- uh, These characters that were already really, I think, well received on, on the internet are sort of showing more humanity um, which is exciting and, and, and you get to see, um, you know, a bit more into these characters lives and, and what their flaws are and, and what their, um, strongest character traits are as well. And, and, uh, it's wonderful. Uh, BB, your character, um, Lake, you kind of see like what she does. Cause after like the conversation with her mother in the room, uh, you kind of see why Blake does what she does. Um, is she going to have that same mentality or because at the end of season one, you kind of see her like move past that and like with Felix and everything. Do you think she's going to ever revert back to the same way she was? Um, no, you know, I I don't think so. I mean, I, I think that, you know, insecurities will always be a part of a person and and you can try so hard to work on certain things and get through certain things and I think you certainly can and I think she did but regardless you know if something used to haunt you it it will you know always forever be a part of your yourself and in in whatever way and form that takes but no I I don't think it'll be a, a prevalent part of of herself I think she's done a lot of growing up and um, and I think she she really knows how to to take care of herself now and 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 the kind of love that she should be giving herself all because of these like amazing friends that she um, has made. And 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 obviously her relationship with Felix, I'm sure, helps her a lot work through some of those issues. If you guys had to switch like characters with anybody from the show, which characters would you switch? with? Mm-hmm. Oh, you go first on that one. <laughs> I, I mean, like, I always say that I would probably, I would play Mason. I would play Andrew. I would just really like to know what it's like to be like 6'1". <laughs> <laughs> I'm very, very short, by the way. I'm like a full foot and two inches shorter than Mason. So. <laughs> uh, I Yeah, I, um, I, I. I mean, I, I honestly, I don't want to take your answer, but also Andrew, uh, <laughs> I, I just, you know, I feel like playing the bully is fun sometimes. And so it'd be, it'd be a blast. Uh, but uh, if not Andrew, uh, you guys actually haven't met him yet, but Raheem is a great character. And okay. I would like 
to have a crack at that as well because that seemed like a blast. What storyline are you guys most excited for fans to see? Because there's so many different storylines from season two now. Like, what storyline are you excited for fans to see? I'm most excited um, for fans to see some things that happen in the finale of season two. Okay. Um, there are some cheeky little moments that Lake has in the finale that really excite me and, and I can't wait to explore that more. Yeah, I, uh, I'm really excited for uh, the Felix mom scene because uh, that, that one was really interesting to play. And uh, I, I think it adds something to Felix that um, we haven't really seen before. So uh, I'm really excited about that. And I'm also really excited about the, um, uh, the storyline that continues with uh, Victor. Because uh, that gets pretty interesting as well. Where is the buzz? Oh, yeah. Where is the buzz? You said we used to be a singer. Oh, 